Hey guys, this is Rupex, and we're back with episode 5 of Hardcore Minecraft. Now, I'm not sure since the update, yeah, you can see um, the settings were uh, reset, so I'll make sure we're back on Hardcore. Um, two days, and lock the settings. Okay, so we're back to Hardcore, and... As you can see, I changed my texture pack because I kind of got, got bored of the last one. And we're back where we were last time. And we were getting wood, as far as I can remember. Or planning on getting wood. So, this is a John Smith texture pack. It's pretty cool, in my opinion. It's not a. Uh, it's only 32 by 32 uh, texture, so it's not as high detailed as as is the radar used before, but I still like it. And this is the first time really I'm playing it since the update, so I've yet to see some things happen. I mean, uh, more creeps and weirdos was also updated, so now just more mobs. And these trees are really tall. Jesus Christ. Okay, um just over a stack. Turning it into this into sticks so it doesn't take up too much space. Okay, um we have little house, maybe I should expand it a tiny bit. Is that what proc chops look like? I presume that's meant to be a weapon. A sword or something. Yep, stone sword. <laughs> Okay, chests. I need to make more room for that. So that'll take uh, a bit of wood. <laughs> Maybe a bit higher. And yeah, that should be fine for now. There's no point really making a bed since I can't use it. I should probably store away some stuff. I'll carry the cobblestone around just in case. Um, yeah, half a stack of coal, I'll leave it here and I'll take the pork chops because we probably will need food if we get injured. And a hunch back there. I'll just plant these saplings. Uh, stone sword. Should I try killing him? Oh, and... Ah, damn it. Need a map. I said I won't be using it. <laughs> Forgot to turn it off this time. But it doesn't matter. I'm afraid of that it's ooh, I see mushrooms in the distance. That um uh, since this map's been made before the last update, I won't be able to get seeds unless I go to a newly rendered area. Mushrooms. Could do 
with some brown ones. I keep pressing escape for inventory. I've been playing too much Terraria. <laughs> it's a sausage dog. Um, I. It's a pasta one. Ah, damn it. I'll try. Okay, just give it food. I don't know if anything happened. <laughs> and it's turning night time. I also found out there's a new use for bone meal with this update. If you use it on regular grass, it will grow tall grass and has a chance of growing flowers. So now in the servers that have exhausted their flower resources, they have a chance of getting them back. <laughs> I mean, I've been to a couple of servers where they almost use them as flowers as currency because they're rarer than diamonds at that stage. And I'll clear up the front of the house just to make it nicer looking. Meanwhile, we can expand inside. Um, I'll leave the wood like that for now. Um, probably gonna need more space eventually for uh, chests and stuff, but I'll probably make double storage. So now I'll just build something else, like it just underneath here and a chest in the wall there. <laughs> That's a good way of saving space. And you don't have to walk long distance distances to switch between chests and it's a handy way of doing it. Um Because once I do have a chest here, I'll be walking right next to it. I'll make an entrance here. Well, let's see what I'll make. <laughs> and I have to replace the torch again. <laughs> okay, um... Gonna make a vertical shaft down. And hopefully not die as we're doing it. But that's one of the reasons I needed wood to make ladders, so I can drop them down as I'm going along. Eventually, once I do get lightstone, I usually put a lightstone block above the um, shaft, just so. Ah, damn it! Just so I can tell when the I'm reaching the top. I mean, it's a nice way of telling it apart from the roof. Uh, we need pickaxes, lots of them. And we will need some ladders. It's not much, but actually, he's <laughs> it's actually fuck all.
Yeah, that'll do for now anyway. We don't need to get this all done right away. We'll just dig down and see where it leads us. <laughs> it's really dark in here. It's a handy way of digging down because if you remove one block and there's something bad below you're not gonna fall and die um oh that that explains why i don't even know how i place that there either way I shall collect that then. I'm not really short of. We're not short of coal really because, as you saw last episode, I got plenty of it in this map. But, um. It's always handy having more coal. <laughs> And I'm not sure if my time is up yet. Uh, I'll check in a second. And yeah, my time is nearly up. I'll just gather this coal. Is there any more left? I can't really see. Ooh! Iron. <laughs> That's handy. I'll be able to make a pick now. Let's go to place a torch down. <laughs> I'll fill this in because I don't like leaving gaps like that. Oh, great. I like how cobblestone looks in this texture pack. It's just. It's something you build castles out of. I mean, it's really cool looking. Ladders. Place down a torch. And next episode we'll be getting more wood so we can have more ladders. Uh, that one. I'll, I'll get rid of it next time. But anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, thumbs up and subscribe, and see you next time.